GCSE Biology. Welcome. Are you excited for a fun learning session? Make sure you have your book and a pen before we start. Today you will learn about the xylem and the phloem. Transpiration and translocation. Root hair cells are cells that absorb water and mineral ions. The shape of the cell give it a large surface area. Root hair cells have thinner cell walls than most plant cells to make it easier to transport mineral ions into the cell. Palisade cells are the cells at the top of the leaf and site of photosynthesis. Long thin shape gives the cell a large surface area. They have many chloroplasts to capture light energy. The xylem and the phloem transport substances around the plant. Translocation is the movement of sugars, amino acids and other molecules around the plant. The xylem transports water and dissolved mineral ions around the plant. Xylem cells die during development the cytoplasm disintegrates and the top and bottom cell walls break down to leave long empty tubes behind, like a straw. The sides of the xylem are made of lignin, a strong substance and this makes the xylem strong, allowing the xylem to withstand the water pressure and support the plant. The phloem transports sugars around the plant. Sieve cells have a large central channel for sugars to flow through. Sieve cells are connected together by holes in the cell wall and these allow the sugar to flow from cell to cell. Companion cells are cells alongside the sieve cells. Companion cells pump sucrose into and out of sieve cells this increases the pressure and causes the sucrose to move up or down the plant to where it is needed. Companion cells contain many mitochondria to make lots of energy for active transport. Transpiration is the loss of water from a plant by the process of evaporation. Transpiration is the loss of water helps the plant to draw more water up from the roots. This is due to water tension. Water molecules move up the xylem as a long chain. Forces of attraction hold the molecules together so when water evaporates through the leaves more water molecules are pulled up through the plant. There are four factors that affect the rate of transpiration. Wind moves water molecules away from the stomata, pulling more water molecules through. Humidity, the more water vapor is in the air the less can leave the plant. Temperature, particles will diffuse faster in a higher temperature. Light intensity, stomata open wider the more intense the light level are.